What is going on my fellow Bite of 87 enjoyers? It's your boy Illumina here and today I'm going to be bringing you FNAF Zombies in light of the FNAF movie releasing on October 27th which I, I am going to go see on debut so call me a nerd but I've been waiting for this shit ever since I was a wee lad but anyways uh yeah FNAF Zombies map I've never played this before I saw the pictures it looked pretty cool if I can remember, I will credit whoever made it. In the description, quick side note, I'm looking for some people to play Tim Hansen's Last Man Standing maps with me for my YouTube channel, so leave a comment if you're interested. Consider joining my Discord, link in description. If you want to be in a video or just hang out with some other people who like zombies, make sure to like and sub if it's your first time here so you can catch a new video every time it drops, so. And while you're at it, go check out the rest of my channel. I've got some cool videos just like this one for you to go watch. And without further ado, let's get into it. Uh, I hope this is a door because I'm kind of fucking trapped over here. This kind of just looks like the little security office thing. I heard that there is a viable ending, so I will probably try and achieve that. And I should also probably look into... Wow, the zombies are stuck right there. I should look into getting a weapon soon, because uh, I am almost out of ammo on this 1911. Right, let's see, what is out here? 1500 points. Is that a grease gun? It is. Oh, I hate that I can't prone under fucking under perks to get drops or 100 points. What am I saying? Bowie knife. Oh shit, I thought that was another door that scared the fuck out of me. This map is dark as shit though. I want to try and see if I can find that viable ending just to see what exactly I'm going for. Anyways, I am fresh out of bullets. Well, now I am. So I'm going to resort to this fucking grenade. Hopefully it kills like enough to hit the box but no it's not gonna do that all right yeah let's just hit the box let's see what is in here it looks like a bunch of world war ii guns also uh ooh, cool smg let me address the elephant in the room i have not uploaded in over what i think it's gonna be either six days or a week at the time of uploading this video so i just uh sorry everyone i just got more busy and the crews and all that shit kind of just sent me into like a spiraling mess of i gotta upload like every single day so it was kind of draining i should probably buy quick revive but yeah hopefully i get back on to the more consistent uploads i don't know if any of you guys have ever looked at my description and read what's in there and i i said that there's not really an upload schedule but if i do upload it'll be around 3 p.m mst i might want to change that because i was thinking about having an upload schedule just so that you guys know like when to when to expect a new video and it'll keep me on top of actually doing shit instead of just you know wasting my time when i could be uploading shit all right we have a cool 3k points here almost Pack the punches in the wall. I should go look for power. Hold on. I'm going to turn up the brightness. Uh, okay, the brightness the brightness is max. That might be a little bit of a problem because I can't see fucking shit. What's in here? Was, it, was this a useless door to open? You know, excluding speed cola. I am quite disappointed with my purchase. It's probably in this door that costs 2,500 if I had to guess. Ooh, a double points. That is going to be very nice for us. All right, fuck it. Yeah, let's just let's just spray. No more knifing. But yeah, another reason that I haven't really been uploading, I don't want to make excuses, but I mean, this happens to every YouTuber. Just as like rappers get writer's block, YouTubers have no fucking clue what to upload. There's a shit ton of custom. Ooh, that is fucking terrifying. Please get writer. Oh, a little bit of frame lag. But yeah, YouTubers have no fucking clue what to upload sometimes, so please uh, give me some ideas because uh, part of the reason your boy has not been uploading is because I have no fucking clue what to upload. There's a whole plethora of custom maps on the Steam Workshop that I could upload like all the time every single day, but I don't know. Custom maps are cool. The challenge challenges feel more fun to me, and plus I want to I want to have your guys's input as well. So just let me know what you guys want to see in the future. I might make a little poll on the community tab. The whole 250 subs video. Dude, I have no clue when I'm going to do that. Shit, I'm already at 300 subs, which is one, crazy. Thank you. But two, like, damn, your boy does not know when he's going to fucking make that video. Oh, wait, is that the Bible ending? 60, 62,000 points, pretty much. I feel like this is a FNAF reference. It's 1987, so... It's probably referring to the Bite of 87. If there are any FNAF nerds in the comments, correct me if I'm wrong, but I am one of those two. So I guess that is our goal. Let's go with the box again. There are a lot of cool guns in here. A browning, okay, yeah. 
This is a gun I can get behind. I hope this video doesn't get copyrighted just due to the ambience and some of the sound effects from FNAF. So if it does, then uh, sorry YouTube. Honestly, I don't even need anything else. I'd like to see what's on that. Ooh, Widow's Wine. Uh, yeah, I might be taking that statement back, but uh, as of right now, I don't really need anything else. It's kind of just a race to get to uh, 62k points, which is going to take a while. I'm going to assume round 27 is when we'll get there. This fucking gun is OP. It is kind of annoying how it just shoots the zombies heads off though, instead of actually like fully killing them immediately. But I mean, oh well. Small price to pay. Holy shit. Let's give the browning a little... A little bit of action here. Okay, the round's already over. You know, I bet I could do this entire challenge without pack-a-punching the guns. Probably even without double tap. I mean, they're just that strong. Whoever ported these guns over from World War II made them a bit OP. But man, 300 subs is crazy. It was like fucking, it was only like two months ago that I was still at like 80. And before that, it was only like three months ago when, uh, maybe like four, four and a half months ago where I hadn't had much traction at all on my channel i was at like i was at maybe like eight subs then boom out of nowhere one of my videos blows up and that boosts me all the way to like 60 subs and from there that was the start of what you're seeing now the funny thing is people say put more effort into your videos and you'll get better rewards you know like more views and shit which is true like i don't want to discourage uh like putting effort into your videos for youtube but i was at i was at such a redundant state in my youtube that i i was like you know what fuck it i'm just like no more thumbnails i'm just gonna upload fucking lowly qual low quality edited videos with i'm not even gonna bother making a thumbnail and that was the first time i had done that and ironically it fucking blew up so yeah i mean after that i continued not making thumbnails for a bit but as I already knew would happen, uh, my views slowly started regressing. That, that was my one fear with when that video blew up. I told Will, I was like, I just sincerely hope every one of my videos after that will get 100 views. And for about two videos, they did. But after that, uh, yeah, no, I faded into obscurity again. So I was like, you know what? It's time to put effort in. And what do you know? After about a month. You start making holy fucking shit, dude. Two OP LMGs. But after about a month, you start making top fives, and then boom, you just blow up, and your subscriber count triples within like three months. It's crazy, and I'm very fortunate for this. So let's get to 500. We are already a good third of the way there to being able to buy that Bible ending. I'm telling you, dude, I'm not even gonna have to pack a bunch of these guns. They're just too OP. I kind of do want some variety in my guns though, so I'll probably pick up something other than an LMG. I might need double tap though, because this shit is slow to rechamber a bullet. Yeah, this is definitely a lot less reliable, but I mean, it's fun, so. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh shit, oh fuck. Oh, why did you pick up the car? Why did you pick up the car 98K? You silly man. All right, all right, all fucking right. Holy shit. Okay. <laughs> well, all that confidence that I had is just gone. Yeah, I was going strong too, round 13, and I had about 20k points. Thank you guys all for watching. I talked a lot during this video, so there's probably going to be a lot of a lot of yip yapping, a lot of jibber jabber. But I don't know. Hopefully, you guys watch till the end. If you did, uh, you have my thanks. Let's get to 500 subs. Thank you all for watching, and as always, peace.